everybody and welcome back to my channel or if you're new here welcome to my channel my name is Kat and I am a flight attendant for a major US airline now with that intro out of the way I think it's pretty clear I travel all of the time like all of the time majority of my days are spent traveling so with that being said I like to think of myself as a little bit of a travel expert especially when it comes to travel products and travel accessories and things like that that I know are going to be super super useful to travelers like myself but there are a lot of travel products. It's a very oversaturated market, especially with bags. So it does take quite a bit to impress me. And let's just say this bag did it. This is going to be one of the best travel bags you're going to see in 2020, in my opinion. Okay, so to start off with, this is actually the Bento bag by the brand Nomad Lane. Now, Nomad Lane is a small company and they are run by a husband and wife team, which kudos to you guys. I don't know how you can live and work with somebody and not just want to completely pull your hair out. But this is a great bag. I'm super excited to show it to you guys. So one of the first differences that you're really going to notice in this bag versus the bags that I have shown you in the past is the design. This design is much more male and female friendly, whereas I know some of the bags in the past have really been designed more for women. Not to say that women are the only ones that can use the bag, but they have been more female designed. This bag is pretty much universal for everybody. It is very, very, very sleek and professional professional. The company did have a phrase in mind when they were designing this bag and that is from boarding to board room, which I think they killed it. They really did kill it. It's so sleek. It's so professional. It's for men. It's for women. It's for everybody. And they did such a great job, but obviously you're not going to just impress me with the exterior of the bag. There is a lot of good stuff going on here. So when you buy your bento bag, it does come with this little pamphlet right here for you guys to check out, which I highly recommend. It has some great features and some good information inside as well as their socials and everything like that. But when you turn it to the first page already, one of the things that makes this bag so unique is its size. So as you can see here, it fits completely underneath the seat in front of you. Majority of planes that are standard size, this is the exact measurements that they are going to allow you to bring as a personal item to go underneath your seat. So you should never have to worry when you take this onto a plane that they are going to make you check it. It is the great size. It gives you plenty of space still in front of you, but actually tucks in. So in the case of an emergency, your neighbor is not going to trip over your bag. They are going to be able to get out and the airline is going to let it on the plane, which is a good thing. <laughs> Okay, so just to get that out of the way, now let's actually get into the features of the bag, which are really exciting. From the front of the bag, as you can see here, is there is clearly a tag. So you can store your information in there in case the bag gets lost or anything like that. And then also, as you can see, it does have this front pocket in the bag. Now, I did get the bag in black with chrome zippers. So if you can see the detailing on that, I did choose to go for chrome. This is their best seller, but they do come in other colors that I will be putting down below for you guys to check out. And instead of chrome, you can also choose to do silver hardware, completely up to you what you would like to do. But I did pick the black chrome. Now, one of the first things that I really love about this bag are actually right here in the hardware. It's the zippers. These zippers are so sleek and so easy. I have had numerous bags that I love and adore, but they do sometimes have a really hard time opening it or the zipper snags. It really is just like, okay, I'm done. But anyways, once you open the bag right there, you're going to go into the front pocket. Can you say hi? You like the bag too? You like the bag too? Okay, sorry, my dog just woke up. But like I was saying is when you do open the front pocket right here, it does have a lot of security features in this bag. Starting actually over here to the left, it does have a nice little zipper pocket so you can put any cards or anything like that into the bag that you would like. This bag has a ton of storage, a ton of storage, which if you're traveling, that's one of the most important things in my opinion that a travel bag should have is it should be a great size which I'm five foot for reference. So the bag might actually look pretty big compared to me, but this is the perfect travel bag size, like I've said. This bag is going to be great when you're working. It does have a lot of features, like the pin pocket here and some of the other good stuff inside that is going to make this a great bag to go from boarding to boardroom. But not only that, but this bag also to me makes a great international carry-on. So when you are traveling internationally, this bag is like music to my ears, and you're going to see why when we get to the inside of the bag. Sorry, I'm getting ahead of myself. 
but it is. I think it's going to be a really great dual purpose bag. But anyways, so as you can see, there are some pockets right here and this pocket actually has a little carabiner. So you can attach your keys and then tuck them into that pocket right there. So they're nice and well hidden, but you always know where they're gonna be at. So when you get to your car, you're not searching around for your keys, which I have said this is one of the best features of a bag to me because as soon as I get to my car, after I've been in the airport all day long, the last thing I wanna be doing there is standing, shuffling around for my keys, which it's happened to me a lot, a lot more than I'd like to admit. So now I specifically search for bags that do have a place to attach your keys to. And this one actually is gonna have a couple places that you could, but to me this is going to be the most security friendly, so that's probably where I would put my keys. Okay, so then you may be looking at this right here. So this is actually a charging port. You're never going to have to worry about your devices not being charged any longer. So you can actually take your favorite battery port and plug it into this, so your portable charger, and then put it in here. And actually on the side of the bag right here is a place to attach your charger and then to your phone. So that way you can actually charge your phone through the bag and you don't have to be holding the battery pack and the charger and the long wire. You'll literally have the wire just going right out and then be able to be on your phone at the same time that it's charging. So that way you never have to worry about your devices dying while you're traveling, which I know can be super, super, super disruptive if you need to catch a ride, if you need to call a taxi, if you have business stuff to be handling. That's never stuff that you wanna to have to go through, especially when you get onto a plane that you thought were gonna have chargers and then it doesn't. So problem solved. Okay, so now that you've seen kind of the front pocket, you've seen all of the storages, there's two mesh parts right here, two more pockets right here. We're gonna go ahead and zip that up and then I'm going to show you now the back of the bag. So this bag does have a trolley sleeve in the back that will fit over any suitcase handles. So that way, if you do have a suitcase as well as your bag, you don't have to worry about holding it. You can just slide it in there, set it on top, and then there you go, your hands free other than your suitcase. Now on the trolley sleeve as well, it does have a pocket, so you can put important documents on there. So I do recommend go ahead and putting your boarding pass in here as well. That way it's really easy to find, really easy to get through. So as you're going through security, it's easy to take it out, easy to put it back in, so that way you're not gonna lose it, you don't have to worry about it, it's right there. You can also put your passport in here as well, so that way if you're going on international travel, your boarding pass and your passport will both be in the same part. I do recommend though that after you get onto the plane, you probably move the boarding pass inside the bag. You never want it just easy access on the outside, but as you are going through security, that's a great feature to make everything easy to get to. Okay, so now let's get into all the good stuff on the inside. So to start with, there are three ways to carry the bag. There's the trolley sleeve, there's the handles right here with the clasp, at the top but there's also a strap inside so you can connect the strap on both sides of the bag from the hardware right there and it does have a strap to go across if you would prefer to carry the bag like that so we're gonna open the clasps and let's actually go back to the front of the bag so at the front of the bag there's two zippers one here and one here so we're gonna go ahead and open them both so these actually go into two separate compartments so the compartment right over here on the right side of the bag actually comes with a little bitty case right here. So this is going to be great if you have a sleeping mask, if you have eyeglasses, if you have sunglasses, if you wanna put chargers, if you wanna put wires or cords or pretty much whatever you would like to store inside here. That's a great little secret pocket that you can actually store some stuff in and it does come with the case if you would like to use the case as well. So that's actually a great little pocket. So you can use the case, you don't have to use the case, but it does give you a nice little storage section right there. And then you can go ahead and put that back in here. For me personally, that would make a great camera section. I know I like to travel with my camera. So that actually would be a great place to store my batteries, my SD cards, my camera, and so on and so forth. But then when you get over to here, this is another feature that I think makes this bag great for international travel. So if you are going overseas, this is going to be a great bag to use, and here's why. So in this compartment, it actually has a little bitty toiletry bag. So if you're on a long haul flight, chances are you're going to need to brush your teeth and freshen up, especially if you are actually able to sleep on the flight. So this is actually going to be a great feature to go ahead and throw a toothbrush, some toothpaste, maybe a comb, maybe some travel hairspray or whatever you need to freshen yourself up after a long haul flight. But also if you are trying to go from a plane to a business meeting, this is another easy, easy way to freshen yourself up. There's a lot of features in this bag that you're gonna see are gonna be great for all of the above. So it's such a versatile little nice travel bag. Okay, so now we are actually going to go into the middle compartment, right in the middle here. And this is a very, very unique, cool feature of the bag. So the zip is right here, and we're just gonna open it on up. And this bag actually lays flat. 
like a suitcase. You actually have a portable carry-on bag that can act like a suitcase. That is so nice. And the reason that I think this feature is so nice is because I'm even picturing being in my seat and needing something out of the bag to be able to sit there and open it kind of in my lap and get to what I need. Or even if the bag is like this and I can kind of accordion style to get pretty much access to all of the bag from right into the middle. That is an awesome design, great feature. Kudos to Nomad Lane because I think they did a great job designing that. Okay, so on this side right here, as you may notice, it does have the mesh lining. Okay, so you see these two bags right here, and these are actually the storage bags that you saw at the front. So this is your toiletries over here, and then right on here is your tech stuff or your sunglasses or whatever you decided to put in here. So the mesh feature does allow you to put stuff in here that you can actually see what it is. For me, I would probably put clothes in here or even my shoes in here. This bag does come with two shoe bags that you're gonna see later on in another pocket, but you can actually store some shoes right here and then lay like an outfit on top. So maybe you wanna wear your pajamas on the plane with your tennis shoes, cause safety, but, but yeah, maybe you wanna wear your pajamas or something really comfy or some sweats or something on the plane. And then actually when you leave and go out, you can actually have a spare change of clothes in there. Or another option, if this is a business bag for you, you can put on something comfier when you're on the flight and actually put your business attire in here or vice versa. It gives you the ability to change your clothes on the plane or just use it for any other storage thing that you might wanna use it for. That's just kind of my creativity. I would probably put an outfit in there. So I would just put my shoes in there, fold everything on top and bam, good to go, zipped it up, nicely organized and I can see exactly what is there. So for me, that's a great feature as well because if I'm commuting up to Charlotte for work, even though I live in Dallas, I can wear something comfortable on the plane like my sweats or something and actually put my uniform in here. So that way when I get to the airport, it's easy access to my uniform to get changed. Maybe I'm doing airport standby. So boom, bam, there you go. Or I can change right before a trip. So to me, that's a great feature for flight attendants as well. Now let's go to this side of the bag. So this side of the bag actually offers you different pockets. So this has a laptop feature, which y'all know I need my laptop. I have to edit my YouTube videos. I have to work. I have to check emails. I have to do a lot of stuff. I need to do my bidding and schedule stuff as a flight attendant. I need a place to store my laptop. So this does fit a standard 15 inch laptop very, very easily. So it does have a front pocket. So any laptop stuff that you wanna store in here, maybe a mouse, maybe your charger, pretty much anything can go into that front pocket. And then right there, you got a big old comfy pocket to store your laptop. So you can go ahead and put your laptop in there. You can have the case on it, or you can just use this. This is padded, so it does have some stability for your laptop. Me personally, as you'll probably know at this point, I like to carry it in its laptop case. But there you go, you have laptop storage, you have a place to store all of your laptop accessories as well. So that's another great feature if you are traveling internationally or for business, or maybe if you are doing international travel, you can put like some magazines or some coloring books or pretty much whatever. Storage is always going to be your best friend when you are traveling, like I have said. Okay, so now it actually does have a zipper that goes along the side right here. And it actually has a dual zipper, so you can actually kind of open it from both sides, pretty much whatever you wanna do. So we're just gonna go ahead and glide that on open. And this gives you access to your back storage compartment. Now this back storage compartment also actually has its own zipper right here. So you don't actually have to open the entire bag to get to the storage department. But if you do have the bag open like a suitcase, you can get to that compartment, which makes it very, very nice. It's accessible in two different ways. So now that you've opened it, like I've said before, there are two shoe bags in here. So one of these shoe bags can actually go to the mesh pocket. You can store some shoes in there right there. Maybe you want another pair of shoes for some reason in here, or maybe you want to put both shoes in here. Completely up to you. So for example, if I was in my comfortable sweats, but I didn't want to bring my uniform along, I can have my in-flight shoes. I can have my heels both in here good to go while wearing my comfy tennis shoes and my sweats as I'm commuting to work. So thinking realistically, that's a great option for somebody like me. So this also does have that strap that I was talking about as well. So it's a nice padded strap, really, really sturdy, really well designed. And again, it does have the brass hardware on there. And then you have this entire storage space. So for instance, maybe you wanted to put something else in here. Maybe you wanted to put some snacks or some goodies or whatever. So that way you can get in and see whatever snacks you got in there. And maybe you wanna put an outfit in here. You could actually probably fit I would say two to three outfits. If you're packing smart, that's two to three outfits worth of space. I mean, that's a big space compartment. Like that's half a hand right there that you can store some stuff. So you could actually put a couple outfits in there, maybe a pair of jeans, a shirt, socks, underwear, and you're good to go. 
or if you have other stuff that you need to bring along with you ladies stuff that you put in your purse you can go ahead and stick in here for us flight attendants your required items that's a great space to put them in as well so your oxygen mask your flashlight things like that that's a great storage space to put just your other accessories that you need to put in there and then again you can get to it from two different compartments so if you are just storing your daily necessities some gum some wallet I don't know basically you know stuff that people travel with if you throw it in there you have two ways to access it which I think that's really really unique really cool he wants to be in my videos so badly if you heard any barking or growling or moaning in the background he just loves the attention and he just wanted to say hi so I'm gonna do my best to edit it out but we're gonna see how well that's going to work I love you too <laughs> okay so now to wrap things up I'm gonna go ahead and put this we'll go play in a minute okay so now to wrap this up I am going to go ahead and put this back and zip it up and show you exactly what I was talking about so let's zip the whole bag up and then we're going to this back zipper right here so we're gonna open that on up and as you can see you can get to that exact storage space that I was talking about there's lots of storage room in here and it doesn't just open wide out so not everything is going to dump out so maybe you have some stuff in here that you don't want to just have flying around then that gives you that zipper pocket as well that's a little bit more secure in there and then on the side right here is another carabiner so you can attach your keys to this as well but like I would recommend I would go ahead and do it in that front pocket right there and then stick them into the pocket but you can also put a keychain on here you can put some fun stuff that way you can identify your bag so if you are doing any kind of international travel, if you're doing any kind of business travel, if you're doing any travel, actually this is a bag you should have your eye on. This is a bag for you that you should definitely check out. You are going to get your use out of it. It's very, very well made, nice hardware, great quality. Nomad Lane, you absolutely killed this bag. I know a lot of y'all have reached out to me in the past wanting coupon codes on bags that I have shown you and Nomad Lane did agree to give me one for showing you guys this bag. And I am so excited for y'all to check this out. This is such a special bag. I will definitely have all the information down in the description below for you guys to check out. So you can go get yourself a bag, go get your dad a bag, your mom a bag, your friends a bag, everybody a bag. <laughs> But anyways, thank you so much for joining me. Please go ahead and give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy this and you do enjoy videos like this. And please subscribe to my channel if you have not already. And I hope y'all love this as much as I do. <laughs> Bye.